I don't want to talk in my head. So, Andrew Tate did say a thing, like, if he had daughters, he would just want them to be happy. He said, like, uh, you know, if his daughter wants to wear butterfly wings and pretend to be a butterfly, and, you know, he's like, I, like kind of makes you emotional. But, because I felt good where he's coming from. I mean, it's like, that's a really good pure place, right? But he's like, you know, does it put a smile on your mom's face? Well, anyways, I gotta, like, not go too much into it. Because I'm still out in public. But the point is that that's why, like, men have to do the hard shit. It's, like, not like he's saying, like, oh, like, men will rule over women or anything like that. He's saying, like, men got to do the hard shit. And they've got to create value. So that there's, like, the space to not be, uh, to, to not be traumatized. And it's fucked up because I created a TikTok Realizing that, like, because what Andrew Tate says is just, like, don't consume so much content. Like, try to just put out content. Like, if you had to start from the bottom, right, which is kind of weird, like, I got the same from the bottom. But, uh, so I made a TikTok. And, like, immediately, like, it's just fucking porn. It's just, like, it's like the Californication song by Red Hot Chili Peppers. You know, it's, like, hardcore soft porn or some shit like that. Like, <coughs> So, and that's, like, the opposite of a chick just being happy, like, like, that's, like, I think he also says, too, you know, like, if a, if a chick's, like, really, really, uh, promiscuous or whatever, and she's just, like, chasing after, like, what she can get in the fleeting times of her youth, and she doesn't, like, like, have a strong connection with her children and everything. And then her grandchildren, like, he talks about in their, in their elder years. A woman in her elder years is, you know. Like, he talks about, he talks with reverence for, like, his grandpa. Ah. That's funny. Uh, so, like, like, I get, like, storms of emotions and shit. But, yeah. Uh, he talks of reverence for his grandma. And he talks about how, like, uh, like, 80, like, I don't know, like, something about there, like, 81 souls or whatever, like, however many grandchildren, like, passed down. All came through her. Came through her, came through her womb, and all that sort of thing. Which is also another reason why, I, like, I can't be a woman. And I have a woman. Boom. I missed a feminine like guy, whatever. Uh, what's the other? I don't know. If they're like, just jumping on the bandwagon or what, or just. There's definitely like um, trauma based mind control. Like Mark Passio talks about that being used against, like, my peers as to why they're being so fucking stupid. But... Yeah, so there's, like, traditional gender roles, and, like, they're there for reasons and whatnot. And, like... I wish I could express myself one way, and there's no reason why I shouldn't be able to. However, I can't, like, pretend that other things don't exist, you know, like... I can't just, like, pretend like I'm a fucking butterfly or whatever if a hostile tribe is invading the fucking, is invading the territory or whatever. Like, at that point, I get drafted in to go to war because fucking men, <laughs> because, because men are built for that, like, like, men are built to throw punches and shit. It's fucking ridiculous, but, and then you got, like, so much competition with each other and, It's almost natural for bad actors to spring up. It's just like, it's ridiculous. But then it's like steel sharpened steel. But I was thinking in my head, I didn't want to just keep it all in my head. 